All right. It's been five days since I came out here and put seeds in this area. And uh, I guess you can see what I've got out there. Different things popping up. You'll, you'll be able to see some up close here in just a second. If you notice, I think, I think that's beets. Can you see my finger? Oh, there we go. Pretty sure that's beets. That's a spinach. That's a spinach. And then these things, right? These might be actually uh, well, there are radishes out here, so they, not, no, not radishes, but we've got beets, and then I've got turnip greens, so some of these are turnip greens, I'm not sure which, but I've got different things growing out here already, you can see them all in here, different little odds and ends, some things in here may actually be uh, weeds, <laughs> but I've got, I'm actually seeing three or four different types of little plants right here growing. All right. I don't know exactly how long it took them to sprout and get out of the ground, but I was saying it would probably take three days. And we, we did get a bunch of rain. And... Uh, but it's been five days since I came out here and did this. Um, yeah, I mean, as, as time goes, I'll be taking, you know, clipping back, you know, grass and stuff like that. But I've got just a ton of stuff in here growing. A ton in here, it's wonderful. Man, when this stuff takes off, I mean, it's already taken off, I'm just loving it. It's been rained on, it's getting some good sunshine. And, uh, man, I got like three mosquitoes on one knuckle. Damn mosquitoes. Get on my head, too. But you know what? I'm so glad I've got this little garden out here. I need to come out here and, and Pick some more uh, uh, tomatoes and odds and ends like that. But there should be a lot more stuff popping up down on this end down here. Um, some of these little seeds that I put in here might actually take a little, little bit longer to germinate and sprout than some of the others. But um. Yeah, like some of my little lettuces and things like that. I don't think I see those yet. So I'll give them another while to, to do their thing. And uh, then I'll start coming out here and, you know, getting up all the little bits of grass and odds and ends like that. I don't want to start pulling up grass to, and I don't, don't want to like mess with the roots of any of the little tiny plants quite yet. But after it's moist out here, then I'll be able to come out here and actually pick some, uh, or not pick some, but pull some grass up. So that's wonderful. Uh, here's my melon. I'm gonna have to get down in there. Gotta get down in there some tomatoes out. Oh, look at those tomatoes. All right. Whew. I'm gonna walk around the other side. I oh, know I've got a big mess. But hey, sometimes a big mess, you know, can be a big benefit too. All right, look at those. Tomatoes all down in there. So I'll be coming out later 
with a little bucket, picking all my little tomatoes. I got some more down in there. Yeah, I got some weeds to cut back in here too. Oh no. That's okay though. All right. Get out, mosquito. Cool. Well, I don't see any signs of critters getting in there. I might have some bugs. I might need to come out here and, uh, and look for like the green horn, horn worms or whatever, whatever you call those things. All right. Whew, I'll come back in, in a couple more days and show you how this stuff's coming along. Cool. Get out, sunshine. Man, mosquitoes were all over me. They're still all over me. It's coming on. All right. Talk to you later. Bye.